Hello students. Hello everyone. In this video, I will tell you about the required things to develop a Java program. Means which software you need to develop a Java program, from where you can get that software, how to install, and how to run the Java program. This everything I will tell you in this video. Okay. So let's start without wasting time. First of all, let me tell you the software which we require to run to develop Java programs. So to develop Java programs, we require a software that is JDK. Okay, JDK, full form of JDK is what? Java Development Kit. Okay. So this software provides everything which is, which are required to run or develop a Java program. Okay. So first of all, I will tell you from where you can get this software. So let's start by this. So for, to install Java software means JDK, open browser in your computer, any browser, whichever you have. Here I have opened Google Chrome, okay? And type here, search here, JDK. Okay, just type here JDK. Okay, see this uh, oracle.com. Click on this first search list, uh, search Java IC download. Okay, this is uh, official site of JDK. Then click on JDK download and then scroll down. Here you'll get this uh, Windows. If your soft, uh, this is available for 64 bits only. So Windows 64, here uh, it is available for Linux, available for Mac, and it is also available for Windows. So whatever you have, which uh, operating system you have, here I have Windows, so I'm installing for that. This uh, will come. Then click on this, uh, select this, I received and accept, then click on this. The downloading will start, you can see, downloading have, has been started here. Downloading is going on, means the uh, setup will be installed, uh, will be downloaded in your computer. You can see here, the process is going on, it's downloading process. Now click on this to install the program, to install the software, sorry. So click on this. So click on yes. Now I'm installing the software, okay. Now click on next, simple, click on next. The process is going on, see. Installation, installation process is going on. Okay, then here close. Then close the, your browse, close your browser, then here open this PC. In this PC, go to C drive. Here I have Windows C or C drive, you know, open C drive. And here you'll get the folder program files. Click on this, double click on this. Then you'll get a, a folder Java. Click on this. You can see this folder. Right click on this and copy. Right click on this folder and click on copy. Then come back to your C drive. You can see Windows C. And at any place, you see we click on right click, right click of your mouse and click on paste. That software, that folder which you have copied from there will be pasted here. Okay. We have brought here. Now you can see this uh, folder name. Please remember this folder name. I'm changing it. You can change it by you can rename it. Just I'm clicking right click on this, right click on this and rename and just make it simple. You can make it uh, JDK 16.0 only. So rename it. Okay. It will be useful. Uh, let me tell you I, I, why I'm doing this renaming that I will tell you. Okay. JDK 16.0. Okay. You can rename it. Then 
here type type here cmd you know to open the command prompt click here cmd this at this page type cmd command prompt will appear click on this this command prompt will appear in front of you okay now here you have to type cd slash and the same folder name are you getting this the same folder name this same folder name jdk 16.0 if you have installed jdk 1.5 you have to write the same folder name what which version of uh, software you have installed and what is the name of that folder the same thing you have to type here it is jdk 16.0 that's why I, I have renamed it it will be easy to type okay so jdk 16.0 so here we'll type cd slash this i have type c that when i'm typing cd slash jdk 16.0 slash bin please see carefully what i have typed and exactly like this you'll type and folder name must be same as the folder uh, that i've shown and press enter after typing this press enter so you can see when I have opened, it was C users Anand. After typing this command, now it is what? JDK 16.0 bin. Means bin folder has been opened. Just assure that bin folder has opened or not. If it is not open, retype. Re check your command, what, have, what you have typed here, and retype it. Okay. So please assure that bin folder has been opened. Otherwise, your program will not run. Okay, then type here Java. Sorry, sorry, type here Notepad and file name, whatever file name you want of the program file. You can type any file name here. I'm typing a dot Java and press enter. This Notepad will open. Okay, and click on yes, and this is the place where we type the program where we type the Java program. So uh, simplest program I'm typing here just for the sample. Okay, so, so see here I've typed the simplest program of Java to print anything. Here I'm uh, printing, printing first program. This message will be printed on the screen. Simplest uh, program I've typed here. I will explain, I will make the video to explain the program also how to write the Java program. That also I will uh, for that also i will make a video uh, further so today just think this is a java program and what this program will do this program will print first program this message will be printed okay after typing the program see carefully after typing the program click on file and save okay click on file and save please don't forget to save then minimize this notepad then come back to this uh, command prompt this is called command prompt now type here after typing the program, click on save and minimize the notepad. Then you type Java C. Okay, Java C. Give a space. And then file name dot Java. What is the file name? Here I have taken A. So A dot Java. This is the file name A dot Java. Don't forget to write dot Java here and here. Okay. After typing Java C A dot Java, this Java C is the compiler. You know, this is compiler. It compiles the program. So press enter. After typing this, press enter. So your program has been compiled. I have taught, I have made already one video for this. The Java uh, requires both compiler as well as interpreter. You can see that video. And here we are compiling. This Java C is the Java compiler. And what this Java compiler does, it converts, converts your source code. This is called source code. Which program you type, it is called source code. Okay. So Java C, Java C converts your source code into bytecode. This this concept I've already discussed in a previous videos. You can see. So Java C A dot Java. Now your program has been compiled. It has been converted to bytecode. Now to run the program, to run the program, we type Java space class name. See what the class name I've taken here. I've taken class name as program. So here we'll type Java space program and press enter. You can see this 
program is printing first program which we have written here as i told this program is to print the message any message first program okay so this is the complete process to uh, to install a software which is required by the system to develop a java program and how to compile and how to run the java okay so any confusion you can ask in your comment section watch this video carefully thank you bye